Hello to all the guys and gals who are self-made repair people. This is an introduction on how to attach a grass catcher that wasn't specifically made for this model. I purchased this grass catcher unit from Facebook Marketplace at a local homeowner's house. I got it for $85 which is about 7% of what they cost new. That is the reason I was willing to take a chance on making it work even though it didn't fit when I first brought it home. I got the idea of melting it to make it fit from the YouTube videos I have watched. This is why I'm making a video about this for anyone who finds themselves in a similar situation. I want to caution you though that this could be dangerous because if the plastic starts on fire it can get out of control very quickly. So be prepared with a fire extinguisher and a water hose and maybe a friend who can help you. Also do this in an area where you can't start anything nearby on fire. Even though this video doesn't show it, the plastic did briefly start to burn and I turned the torch away until it went out. Be very careful not to overheat the plastic. The following is already in progress. What I'm trying to do is get this to fit onto my mower and since the back section here is lower than it should be. I want to melt this so that this piece goes out and comes around like that. And I have some water. If it gets too bad, I can douse it out. Trying to get the stretchy rubber with a hook to fasten into a hole I drilled in the deck. The purpose is to keep the chute tight against the mower deck in its proper position.
here I am fastening two 3 16th bolts through the deck of the mower and through the plastic grass catcher. As you can see, I've got the whole thing put together. I put a, two bolts down through the top of it, and drilled them right through the deck. I fastened my spring loaded thing up here, which you would have to have some way of fastening the front of that to the deck. And you can do that uh, with a self made uh, strap that you could bolt onto the deck. And the same thing, you would do that on the back side as well. And that will hold that thing in place. You can see it's a little rough there, but it fits on there. It works quite well. I have not had any problem with the grass not going through the system. And uh, so that's a simple way of doing that.